All right, peeps. I'm back on this channel. <clears throat> I was on my uh, backup channel for this channel. And so I'll leave the link in the description box of this video so you guys can find that channel. Because if this channel ever goes down or I get, well, if I get another strike, I'm gone for two weeks. Um, so... I'll, I'll put that in there so if you guys want to know you know some people are like well where you go leave links and so on so i leave links in every single uh description box of all my videos but what i'm about to do with this uh channel now the one that i'm on right now i'm gonna start uh looking i'm gonna start basically there are a whole bunch of youtube creators out there who are putting out a lot of content about what's going on and uh they're they're being really creative like like calling it sci-fi and you know doing things so they can't get censored and they can't you know get in trouble but what the beautiful thing about this is there are so we're in a time we're in an age of technology and, and, and information and i truly don't believe if you guys remember my old my takes, I always used to tell you guys about how I don't think there's ever been a time in human history when uh, where this many people have been this stupid at once. But although that is in my mind, this is just my opinion, I'm not saying this is true. I also believe at the same time, this is the we're in a time of history where there are more woke people or not. Let's not say woke because everybody says that there are more people who are uh, figuring out what's going on. And let me tell you why the mainstream. This is why the mainstream media is putting out all of this propaganda, all of this misinformation and all of this stuff so they can combat what they call so-called conspiracy theory, theorists or theories. Like order out of chaos. Chaos is not a theory. Um, uh, uh, the plan for a new, you know what, order is not a theory. If you are on any one of my channels and you think that, you I don't I, I don't even I don't even want to say what I really think about you because then you know somebody will take it. Somebody else might hear him like that. <laughs> He's a jerk. Because how? Anyway. Um, so I'm going to be sharing a lot of videos from different creators and just showing you that they're so nervous right now and they're so they don't know they don't know what to do, y'all. They really don't know what to do. Because now with this whole mandatory this, mandatory that, they're getting a lot of pushback from real Americans, not you fake Americans who think that you, you know the government is literally uh can has some type of power to take over our lives and make decisions for us and all that stuff. You people got problems. If you want to be in paranoia land, uh, water your grass or cut your bushes with your stupid little mask on, and you want to go inside of a restaurant and have it on or whatever, you do that, but you don't look at nobody sideways because you are nothing. You don't look at nobody sideways like you are better than them. I don't know who the hell you people think you are where people have to Make you feel happy and good. Making themselves feel discomfort and um, uh, loss of human dignity to make your dumb ass feel good. You make your decisions. And you let people make their own decisions. You ain't nobody's mama. You ain't nobody's daddy. Biden's dumbass ain't nobody's mama and he ain't nobody's daddy. The FDD, the CDC, the GB3, the 123, and the ABCDEFG ain't nobody's damn daddy or mama. So you don't tell me shit. Sorry, y'all. My bad. I'm back. But uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I, 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 I can't stand American hypocrites. I can't stand want to be fake patriots. I can't stand these people acting like, you know, any other time, they'd be like, oh, that ain't going to happen in our country. It ain't going to happen in our country. And now they're sitting here and let it happen in the country and making the people who are standing up for their rights into being the bad people. What kind of parent is so idiotic that they don't know that a school cannot make a medical decision for their child? Huh? What kind of parent is that stupid? That they don't even know that a doctor can't even make tell, tell you they can only recommend it. 
Well, somehow you go into Walmart and Wendy's or wherever else, there'd still be a Nazi face mask uh, people at. And I guess they're medical professionals now. Instead of worrying about serving somebody food, counting the money, grilling or whatever you got to do. I ain't picking on fast food restaurants. I used to work there too. Instead of doing that, you're worrying about what the hell I got on my face. <laughs> Y'all, my bank tried that on me. I went in there the other day to deposit some money. <laughs> and I had a, I wasn't sure if they were back on this whole ridiculous mass crap or not. So I, I did, I wore my camera just in case. I get in there. She asked me where a mask is. I said, I don't have one. She hands me one and says that they can't, whatever. I just, I said, okay, thank you. Put it down right beside me. And then I uh, turned my camera on. It was like beep, beep. And then she, did, and she knew then that there was, that she could either cause a scene or do the grown up thing, which is help me what I got to do and then get out as a customer. You people who are sitting here holding people hostage in your stores because it, I, I, you people are ridiculous. I seen people, I seen people swarm. I seen these Nazis swarm old, uh, old lady in a store. An old lady got arrested for not wearing one of those stupid things. And she had a medical excuse too. A cop manhandled her. I just, they have people, and, and she was, there was one lady who was in a restaurant, they, all these Nazis surround her, where's your thing at, she's like, I'm not, you know, I'm not, I don't do that, you know, she's trying to shop, uh, one person was like, well, since you're not going to serve me, I'll just put the money down, and then I'll leave, oh no, you can't do that, that's stealing, what the hell is wrong with you people? Instead of giving somebody the junk and letting them go, you would rather them stand in your store for 30, 45 minutes to an hour, polluting the air, I guess, giving everybody all the germs, instead of just assisting them and get out. You people need to get the fuck out of our country. Excuse my language, guys. What I'm trying to tell you, people like, look, you need this type of attitude because I know it sounds mean, but this day and age... These people or these so-called grown-ups and all of these idiots, they don't understand anything until you talk to them like this and then they want to start listening. When you're nice to them and you're trying to tell them about your rights and all the other stuff that we try to do and be all nice and polite in the beginning, their dumb asses don't get it because they think that the government has the power to tell them what to do because they are a bunch of moronic sheeple. And they think what goes for them or what they're told goes for them goes for us too and that's not the case here people are pathetic human beings the way that you are treating your fellow human your fellow citizens American citizens <laughs> all of what your television set is telling you all lies continued lies Oh, there's something going on on the border. Oh, there's uh, something came out of the Wuhan lab. Oh, uh, you know, just the most dumbest stuff to keep you away from the actual problem, which are these so-called EXPERTS and PROS lying to us. Oh no, they're not lying to us. They're, they they have so many years of schooling and so and so and so. When you do school, you're indoctrinated. I don't care. You want me to tell you the truth? If if you really want to be a doctor, you could become a doctor without any years of schooling. See, this is the kind kind of common sense that they don't get yet because they put their uh, faith in a man god philosophy that you have to go to school for so and so years. But a true, real heart do uh, to the heart core doctor will become a doctor on their own. That's a true doctor, not an indoctrinated lab made or uh, established made doctor. That's not a real doctor. They used to have doctors um, uh, promoting cigarettes. So you think I give a damn what they're trying to tell me that these people got a the power to tell me to do when I know they don't? 
I'm going to stop ranting. But that's one I only came over here to tell you guys that. I'm about to just be putting out a lot of work and just showing you that you're not alone. There's a lot of creators out here knowing what's going on. These people are freaked out because they are mad that so many different people are making websites, Facebook pages, YouTube channels. And then they, they think that they're going to discourage us by deleting our channels and doing all of this shady uh, Big Brother 1984 censorship shit. But it ain't going to stop us because we're sick of that crap. We'll make videos exposing how they're doing it. Why you dumbass sheep are sitting there saying that what we're saying is a theory because you're too stupid to go look up something for yourself. Dodo birds. <laughs> you think you're smart. 